Word got around quickly over the weekend. It's ridiculous that the, that the landlord has to take this kind of action. Renters I spoke with said they received no documentation, but were told by word of mouth they'd have to move out within the next 45 days. But it makes us feel really sad and upset because we just finally found a place we could settle down and live our lives and start something. A lot of renters are left asking what can they afford to do once this place closes. No one here has a plan. We're all panicking. We're scared. I don't have anywhere to go. Most of these people don't have anywhere to go. Martha Pittman has been one of the more active renters on social media and started an online petition against the closure, garnering hundreds of signatures in less than a day. She says they're prepared to speak out at this Thursday's Creola City Council meeting. This is uh, an injustice for everybody who lives in here. We're low income families, disability. It's going to turn lives upside down. The property managers said the land sale cleared earlier than expected. They said they're willing to offer extensions in some cases and will assist in looking for other communities for people to live. But at this point, moving seems inevitable. In Creola, Chad Petrie, WKRG News 5.